welcome back to my channel. So today, before we begin, I just want to give a huge shout out to Skillshare for partnering with me on this video. Skillshare is an online learning community for creators and I think it'll be really beneficial for you guys. You guys always ask me how I edit my videos, how I film my videos, and you can find all of that on Skillshare. They have amazing classes. They have over 25,000 classes in business, design, and so, so much more. They even have classes on makeup, makeup theory, color theory, and all of those things, editing, filmmaking. So Skillshare would be a great tool for any of you that are looking to learn something new or become a little better at something you already know. A premium membership can get you unlimited access to all the classes and it's very affordable too. An annual subscription is only $10 a month. I would definitely recommend the Adobe Premiere classes so you can learn all the tricks and basics of editing in Adobe Premiere Pro. There are also filmmaking classes. So those have really helped and I'm sure you guys will love them too. But you can get a free trial as well by clicking the link down below in my description. It's a great deal. I really hope you guys enjoy it and learn something new. And lastly, I just want to give a huge thank you to Skillshare for supporting my channel. Yeah, let's just get into the video. I hope you enjoy. <laughs> hey, welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to be showing you a kind of go-to summery look. Um, it's gonna be very glowy and it'll be natural, not too much. Um, we don't want too much makeup in the summer, at least I don't. Yeah, let's just get into it. The first step of this beauty routine, um, I am gonna be applying some sunscreen. This is a face and body sunscreen and it has SPF 50 in it. It's also very thick, so I, I kind of really love putting it under my makeup because it just makes everything look much more glowy than it actually is <laughs> and I just really really love it. Also sunscreen is good for your skin anyway, it helps uh, prevent wrinkles, it just protects you from the sun. Even if it's not sunny outside, you're still getting <laughs> the UV rays from the sun so just make sure to um, apply a sunscreen every morning. There we go. You see my, my skin is super glowy after this. I don't know if it's the specific brand, but I really like it. That's what I'm going to be doing for priming my face. Um, I even moisturize before I apply the sunscreen, so I'm good. I'm going to be applying the Hello Happy Soft Blur Foundation, and I'm just going to be putting a little bit around my T-zone. And while I have this on my face, I'm going to be spritzing my Beauty Blender with the Bali Body Hydrating Face and Body Mist. Oh, spritzing it. And, oops, <laughs> now that my sponge is nice and damp, I am just blending all of this in. Next, I will be using the Can't Stop, Won't Stop Concealer by NYX. I really like this. Like I've said before, this isn't my shade yet. I really, I either need to get a tan or get another concealer because this is way too dark. Okay, I'm just gonna be spritzing <laughs> my beauty blender again. Now I'm just blending it in. Now for contour, I'm going to be taking the Anastasia Beverly Hills uh, Cream Contour Palette and I'll be using a little foundation brush, dipping into the lightest contour shade and carving out my cheeks. I really like cream contour for a more natural look, it just blends in a lot better with your skin. Okay, so next I'm just going to be using a little bit of the Laura Mercier Translucent Setting Powder. Just a little bit under my eyes, I won't be setting my whole face. So literally just a very small amount. 
this powder is honestly my favorite. It really does the job so well. So right now I'm just gonna be applying a little bit of blush right on the apples of my cheeks. And just... But I do like a little bit of blush on the nose. It's really, really cute. Now moving on to brows, I am going to be brushing them up and filling them in with a little bit of the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow. So now to finish off the brows, I'm just setting them with a little bit of brow gel. I really like this one. It really keeps my brows in place and they like to go everywhere, so that's really helpful. So now I'm going to be using a product that I absolutely love. This is the Freck OG by Freck Cosmetics and it's basically a freckle cosmetic. It just gives you freckles. It has like a little tiny brush like this and you basically just draw all the freckles with this. Um, they look super natural which is what I love because whenever I wear makeup my freckles disappear um, and I do have a lot like around my nose and over here and just all over my body. Starting to draw on over my freckles. You can make some bigger than the others just to make it look as close to your natural ones as possible. And right here I'm just going over my natural freckles. So we are going to blend these out as well so don't worry if it looks kind of crazy. Okay, now that we're pretty much done with the face, I'm just going to be applying some highlight later. Um, I'm going to be focusing on the eyes. So I'm going to be taking the Sweet Peach Palette by Too Faced. I will be taking Luscious right here and applying it all over my lid. Oh, yes, th this is what I wanted. I'm also taking the shade right underneath, which is called Cobbler and Kenneth. Kind of putting it on the outer edges, just blending it everywhere, like it looks so good. So I'm almost done with the eyes, but I want to set my face first because I don't want the mascara to go everywhere. <laughs> so I'm using the Bally Body Hydrating Face and Body Mist. <laughs> I absolutely love this, oh my god. So the highlighter I'm going to be using is Champagne Pop by Beck Cosmetics. And I'm just taking a little bit, curling my lashes. And applying some mascara. And we're pretty much done. Um, I'm gonna be just applying some lip balm, and this is the Coconut Lip Balm by Valley Body. And this makeup look is complete. Thank you so much for watching and I love you guys so much. You've been with me. Thank you for supporting me and my channel and I will see you next time. Bye! Hello.